You know, I wrote Morning Thoughts Become Daily Things because I really have engaged the concept around words and actions. And I have learned through my own practice as a life coach and a spiritual counselor that we only speak what's inside of us and we only do what we really believe. When we believe something, we'll act on it. So I'm saying, well, where does that come from? Well, it comes from our thoughts. Where do our thoughts come from? Other places, other people, other texts. But the other place our thoughts can come from is deep inside of us. So I want to just share that morning thoughts for me are an idea around how our life is going to reflect those things. Our thoughts represent what we truly believe and value. Our beliefs are foundational, informing, and come from an assortment of places. If you want to change your life, change and shape your thoughts every morning and everything else will follow because I truly know now that morning thoughts become daily things and my thoughts, my words matter. In the book, Morning Thoughts Become Daily Things, I offer six simple steps to make sure that that happens. And one of the steps is to think that things get better. Most of the time, we have this doubt that even if I say it and I want it, that it doesn't get better. So in the book on page one, I say that everything happens in the mind. And that the old adage is true, as a person thinketh, so are they. So I would just say that life doesn't get better by chance, it gets better by change. So the first thing you want to do is think, every day and every way, I get better and better. You don't know what it's going to look like, but give yourself space and permission for that to happen. And when that happens, you know, remember to practice it. You know, we don't just get things automatically, we have to put time in. You don't become a good bike rider just by trying it once. Or you don't double dutch good by just trying it once. It's something that you practice over and over and over and over and over again. And so in the chapter that I have called Practice, 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 I say by Hyman Rickover, it says, Good ideas are not adopted automatically. They must be driven into practice with courageous patience. And that patience and practice I'm recommending is 21 days. Do something for 21 days. Allow yourself to rehabit your life. Um, it's not a matter of whether it's easy or difficult. It's a matter of whether this is the thing you believe you want. And what are you willing to do to get that thing? I just recently finished a 21-day rehabiting experience. And I promise you, my life is different. Because there are seasons in our lives that bring us to a point where change is required. So practice. Practice, 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 and practice some more. Don't worry about whether it's everything you want. Just keep doing it. Ride your bike. You will bike soon. Morning Thoughts Become Daily Things by Denise Graves can be acquired on my webpage entitled Peace Ministry, the number two day dot com or at Community Book Center, 2523 Bayou Road. Community Book Center will mail books to you, whatever your location. There's also a book signing upcoming. The hope is to do book signings around the country. In the interim, Community Book Center, 2523 Bayou Road in New Orleans, Louisiana, will be the holder of this book. Or you can find that on my webpage. Peace Ministry, the number two, the word day.com. Thank you so much because I know that morning thoughts do become daily things. Practice.